Procrastination. Procrastination is why we're failing kings. Procrastination is a, is a very subtle monster, y'all. It's very subtle. Listen, you catch yourself or find yourself saying, oh, I'll do it tomorrow. You know what, Monday, that's what I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start my diet. I'm gonna start my workout plan. I'm gonna start this on Monday. You find yourself saying, you know what? I'm gonna do that competition in 2024. And it's 2022. Listen, you might be a procrastinator. Fellow Kings, listen. As I always say in these videos, I'm not saying this stuff, guys, like as if I'm better than y'all. I deal with procrastination. And it, it, it inspires me to be able to speak this stuff and potentially help others as I'm helping myself. So always remember, guys, this is always in a place of, of resonating with you guys and relating to you guys and also connecting with the people who can relate. These are the things that I believe the Most High God is revealing to me, and I'm just passing it on. Guys, pro procrastination winners, true winners, true winners, they don't wait to do what's necessary to do whatever it takes to win. They do it now. So as kings, guys, we gotta, we gotta become do it now people. We have to become do it now men, all right? As long as it makes sense, as long as nobody's gonna get hurt, as long as it's, uh, you know, safe, <laughs> obviously, do it now. Also, you know, there's a clear indication there that when we procrastinate, most of the times when we procrastinate, it's because we're not managing our time correctly and we're not uh, prioritizing our time. Guys, this is one of my biggest weaknesses that I know I have to do what I gotta do and we have to do what we have to do, guys, because winners, kings, we don't really have time to procrastinate. Listen, guys, I don't know about y'all, but ever since I was like 20, let's see, it's about, well, no, 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 I'm gonna take it all the way back to when I used to watch Richie Rich. Y'all know about that movie, Macaulay Cogan, Richie Rich. When I seen that movie, I wanted to be rich. I wanted to be rich. And though I didn't fully understand money or understand riches, I honestly think the reason why I wanted to be rich was because he had a McDonald's in his house and I was hungry as hell back then because I wasn't really eating like that. I really wanted McDonald's. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, but at the same time, I think that sparked a seed in me of wanting to be rich. And guys, in all honesty, most rich people, most, most people who are wealthy, they don't procrastinate, all right? At least they didn't procrastinate before they got rich as much, you know? Because it, it, we have to constantly do what's necessary and what we have to do right away to take care of what we need to take care of. So guys, if you're procrastinating, I'm telling you, average people procrastinate. We gotta ask ourselves, do we wanna be average? Now listen, I use rich riches as an example, but God has revealed a lot of things to me about money and money isn't everything. Riches um, can do a lot, it can help you and it can support a happy life and it's very important, money is very important, but it will never give you that full fulfillment of self, full f inner fulfillment of your spirit, your mind and your soul and what truly makes you happy, all right? Money will never pay for that. Um, so let me make sure I say that. It don't matter how much money you have, there, there's millionaires, billionaires who are unhappy, who, are, who do not have peace in their heart, do not understand what it means to have love and who feel completely lonely, um, in desperation, and honestly a slave to the money and the very wealth that they've gained. Um, so I thank God that he's placed in me the truth concerning money and value and that the true value on this earth is us as people and human beings. That's the real value, guys. We are, humans are, we can make money. It takes people to make money. Um, we make it. So just want to be clear on that. Back to the main topic. Whatever it is that we want in life, procrastination will always push us away from it. And I can't speak for anybody else in it, on this topic, but for me, the things that I usually procrastinate about, you know, I end up, I'll put it off and I'll say, okay, I'm gonna do it this day. And then that day come around and I push it off again. I'm gonna do it another day. Next thing you know, five or six months done went by and I ain't even do it. Guys, this is what's causing us to fail. Nobody's perfect. We're not perfect guys, but as men, we are capable. And we need to utilize all the power that we have. And all procrastination does is it stops us from actually seeing our true potential. So listen, we have to become do it now men, do it now kings, okay? Just do it now. If you could do it, do it. If you got the time, do it.
Because listen, winners, above average, great people, people of greatness, they don't be procrastinating. Whatever it is and whatever it's gonna take to success, they're doing it. Olympic champions, famous people, CEOs, people who are great at whatever it is that they're doing, they practice every single day, every single day to get great at what it is that they're doing. They did not procrastinate, and they practiced and they did whatever they had to do. Kobe Bryant, rest in peace. We got so many good examples in front of us, guys. And all of them say the same thing, man. Don't procrastinate, do it. Do more than what you think you could do. And guys, this is what's gonna help us be kings, solid kings and successful. And we'll be able to also pass it on to others and be an influence, guys. If you guys wanna do that, man, just keep following me. Look, comment below. Do you deal with procrastination? If you do, be honest, be real, man. Put that, put that in the atmosphere and in the, in, the, in the universe, man. Put it out there so that you can release it from yourself. Comment below, Speak, keep it 100. Yeah, man, I deal with procrastination, man. I honestly, I'm starting to see how it's affecting my life and how it's stopping me from being the man that I'm supposed to be. We gotta do something about this, man. How, how much longer do y'all wanna keep living your life as men and not having what y'all want? I don't wanna do it no more. And guess what? We can't blame nobody but ourselves. We can't blame nobody but ourselves. So just like the last video, forget the excuses. Procrastination ain't gonna help us do nothing but hold us back. Guys, let's stop procrastinating and let's be successful men and kings. Salute y'all.